All right, y'all, we're at the finale of the album, at least for now, until the bonus tracks are available. Uh, track 15, the title track, Evermore, featuring Bon Iver. Uh, will it Will it stack up against Exile? One of probably her best feature ever. Um, I don't know, but uh, let's click it to find out. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm bobbing. I've been down since July. Oh, shit. Ooh, shit lyrics. Okay. Shit. Oh, shit. Okay, drop this last track. She's still got that dictionary in her hand. Okay, Justin in the background. He sounds great. Oh yeah, they're layering, they're layering! Oh! I dreamed of you. Ma'am! I love this layering shit. Oh, this piano is so sweet. This has to be Joe playing. So sweet. Y'all, we did it. That's the end of the album. I'm sorry that my lighting got kind of crazy in the middle of this, but you know what? We work with what we got, and what we got is not a lot. So, Evermore was beautiful. Um, it's definitely no exile. <laughs> Let's be real. It's no exile. Beautiful? Yes. A little long. I think that it could be shortened, uh, in my personal opinion. I think you can cut out Bon Iver's verse, if you want to call it that, and just have their layering, uh, and then call it a day and wrap it up. Here's my thoughts as a whole on Evermore. Do I think it's a good album? Of course. But do I think that this album could have been like a seven-track addition to Folklore? Absolutely. Um, because like y'all, y'all saw me, I was going through it, um, in the middle of the album and then thank God, the breath of fresh air that is long story short, thank God for that song. That song really changes the tone of the album on a dime. Thank God for long story short, this album is saved. I will say it. This album is saved by long story short. Nobody, no crime on repeat. Love her. Absolutely love her. Cowboy like me. Long story short, the bop. The bop enchantress herself. Okay. Closure. Really emotional for me. Thanks, Taylor. <laughs> so uh, we're going to have to see how uh, Right Where You Left Me and It's Time to Go hit. Um, as the physical editions come out, we don't know when they're going to come out. Is she going to do a Target release before Christmas so that we can get the tracks? Who knows? Who knows what's going on? Wow, this album was a journey that I was not expecting to take. This took turns that I could not have contemplated. Like, I struggled so hard going to sleep last night. I slept for three hours because I struggled so hard. It's beautiful. I'm sure that it will grow on me. And um, I look forward to that. All in all, I give it a B plus. Yeah, that feels right. That feels right. Maybe a B minus. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you watched these in order and you got to the Evermore one. And you're like, you know what? He's going to wrap it up on this one. I can feel it in my bones. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until two months from now when we get a, the 10th studio album. I will see you all very, very soon. Stay unbothered. Bye.